Hello everybody and welcome back to Sekiro Shadows Die Twice. I think that's the subtitle of this game. So we just rescued this little boy from the tower. He's the heir to something. Prince? Kingdom? I don't know. Let's talk to him. Where shall we go once we're away from the castle? I suppose the first thing we should do is cross the Ashina border. Or perhaps we should hide somewhere. What do you think? Whatever you desire. Whatever I desire? That's the wolf I know. My lord. <laughs> oh, nothing. I was just reminiscing. Onward then. Okay. Is my hair half and half? It's like half black, half gray. Hmm, that's weird. So I was also looking at the menu screen of this. There is leveling up. Skill points. I don't know how you get them. I don't think it's going to be like you get their souls and that's what levels you up. I don't know, maybe it's just like skill points from actually killing the people. What was that? Did I step on a rock? Divine air. Oh, that's a person. Was your uncle's funeral. I thought that was a scarecrow. <laughs> Lord Genichiro. I. I got a feeling I'm not going to win this battle. And that's how I'm going to lose my arm. Alright, dude. I'm level zero. You're probably thousand. Let's do this. Please only have like ten of those red dots. Alright, just two. You face can eat your Ashina. Oh. Oh. What was that? I uh, don't have any more heal like Okay, yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> My arm! <laughs> Called it. Ugh, good thing it was my jacking off arm. I wonder if we actually could have killed him. Is that all the shinobi has to offer? Oh, just you wait. I'll be back. The divine heir will be coming with me. He ran away, didn't he? Who the hell is that witch? Well, that's the end of Sekiro. So thank you all for watching. <laughs> How many games have there been like where you die in the beginning and then like people just say like, well, that's the end of this game. What if they actually made a game like that? You spend $60 and that's it. Well, there's my corpse. Am I under a blanket? Oh, my arm's back. I am now Luke Skywalker. Was this his left arm? I can't remember. So you're awake. Looks like death is not your fate. Just yet. Well, I've died a lot already. Like once or twice. So uh, Shinobi prosthetic. Achievement. The artificial arm of a shinobi passed down by the sculptor. 
replica of the human arm fitted with a variety of mechanisms apparently designed with modification in mind. While it bears a number of cuts and is stained with a thick, stained thick with blood and oil, it has been impeccably maintained. Okay then. Do I have to thank you for this? Are you the sculptor? What do you call yourself? Your eyes. The eyes of a wolf who has failed in his duties. Or so it seems to me. That is not your concern. <laughs> Spoken like a true shinobi. I must carve the Buddha. You do what you will. Uh, talk about the arm. My left arm. What did you do to me? That is what I call the shinobi prosthetic. A fitting fang for a one-armed wolf. Useless when it comes to carving Buddha, though. You can have it. Shinobi prosthetic. It is no mere replacement for your lost arm. Come to me if you find any shinobi tools. Shinobi tools? I see. For this device. <laughs> you catch on quick. I'm guessing those are like bring upgrade shinobi points. Shinobi tools. I'll find a way to fit them to the shinobi prosthetic. Then you'll come to appreciate its worth. <laughs> I've said too much. Go now. Okay. How'd you get here, man? Why am I here? Oh, How'd I get here? Did was drag you here. Didn't even know if I was dragging a corpse. Couldn't let you get eaten by a pack of wild dogs. I mean, you could have. How long was I asleep? <laughs> Some time has passed since I found you. Minutes, you hours, see. days. However, your master yet lives. <laughs> He's being held prisoner <laughs> in Ashina Castle. They will soon make use of his bloodline. Didn't I just get him from there? You. I'm sure you appreciate the value it has. What did you mean when you said they'll make use of his bloodline? I don't know much about him, except... The dragon's heritage. He's There's dragonborn? There's a special kind of blood by that name. And that blood runs through your master's veins. So the divine heir. Someone's after him. Might be that the strange things happening to your body have something to do with that. Do you mean my arm or like, oh god. What the hell? Okay. You're oh, thank you. the strange one. Yet... Other peculiar visitors have come to this temple. There's one in the clearing to the right of the gate leading off the temple grounds. Two strangers in strange circumstances. You two might get along. Alright, thanks. What the hell's wrong with my face? Hold on. Is that like burnt? Ooh, okay. Uh, set to the right. Outside the gate? What is this? X on this. Oh, bonfire. Got it. Sculptor's idol idols serve as checkpoints and can be found throughout Ashina. Resting at a sculptor's idol will completely replenish vitality and restore one use of resurrection. Additionally, quick items and spirit emblems and storage will be added to your current inventory. With some exceptions, resting can also revive defeated enemies. Great. Um, the hell are those numbers? Memory prior bead? Is that stuff I have to find in this area? Probably. Unseen aid, 30%. But, uh, okay. What is this? Sculptor tool? Damn it. <laughs> I say, dude, there's one right outside. Okay, is someone out here? Grappling hook. Shinobi Prosex Grappling Hook allows access to normally unreachable places and a chance to take the high ground. Nearby grappling points are designated with a circular symbol. When the symbol turns green, the grappling point is within reach. Eh? Boom! Sweet. Okay, where's that person you were talking about? Are they the other way? Hello. Are you my friend? Never seen you before. Your name? Oh, 
Won't tell me. But you do have the look of a skilled shinobi. A shinobi. Or perhaps... Hmm. Sir, please heed my humble request. Face me in battle. Oh! Serious? I just killed him. What the? Oh. Huh. Damn. Still alive. Can you teach me how to do that? <coughs> you good, man? I just stabbed you through the spine. Hmm. That swordsmanship. It was a thing to behold. Few have managed to kill me in such a thorough manner. What are you? Some call it undying. Others, infested. I can't die, so I just am. How about you? What brings you to a rundown temple like this? Hmm. My arm. Seems missing. you have a lot on your mind. Say, why don't you use me for some sword practice? Might come in handy for whatever your mission is. A warm body that can't die might prove useful to you. I volunteer mine. Well? Sure. Very well. Right then. Let's go. They say, swinging one sword is a cure for boredom. Huh. Okay, so I have a live training target. <laughs> have you noticed? This temple attracts those with nowhere else to go. I certainly fit that description. Hmm. And I suppose that's why interesting things make their way into the offering box from time to time. This temple attracts those by certain, and I suppose interesting. Is that just the same thing? And I inter okay. Let's try it one more time. Um, um, I think I know all this. Let's try to step touch. case, I stand as your. Uh, okay. You press B to step touch. You evade enemy attacks, then attack, and perform three death blows. Step dodge, and then attack. Got it. <laughs> Ow. Please swing. Did I do it? I'm just killing him over and over again. It's like, come on. Alright. Thanks, pal. You're gonna be my good come friend, I can tell him that. Like. If you have techniques to try out, I'm at your disposal. Okay then. So he said offering box, I'm Items that become unavailable elsewhere in the world. What? End up here in the offering box. When the box is illuminated, it means the item has found its way inside. Items can be obtained by inspecting the box and offering money. You have to offer money to this thing? God damn it. So it's either going to be things you can't carry. Or things you pass by, I guess. I don't know. Okay, I guess we're continuing forward. Grapple. Is this another... Yep. Idol. You can now instantly travel between idols that I've already been communicated with, communed with. Okay. I still have no idea what the hell those prayer beads or memory things mean. Maybe it's a way to, like, upgrade it. I could have easily jumped up that. Unigo Sugar. Ungo? Temporarily reduces vitality damage taken from physical attacks. Okay, so it's like a defense boost. Oh. Not me, excuse me. Does he? He's suspicious. Attack!
Enemy loot. Items and money. Multiple enemies can be looted at once and from some distance away. Sweet. It must be... Okay, so you just press X anywhere and it'll pick up some loot, so... Maybe you pick it up off... Oh. Grapple. <laughs> can you do a drop attack? You have to, right? Hell yeah. Oh, you have to hold it. Got it. I am rich. So, it's open world. Um, I'm gonna be running around a lot looking for stuff. See if I can stealth on that guy. Oh boy. Damn it, you saw me. <laughs> Okay. So can you not grapple in combat? Um, oh boy. It'd be really sweet if you can grapple onto an enemy. Wa boom. Is that guy s Oh, he has a gun. Samurais can't have guns. Get, get it out of here with that bullshit. That be saw me. I will say it is nice not having to worry about stamina in this game. More sugar. Can you even run? Is that running? Okay, that is. Is that another uh, idol? Oh! Duck! I am so sorry. Oh my god! I'm gonna get killed by dogs! Ooh. Hang on a second, guys. Nope. Trying to press X to heal. There we go. Was there another one? Pellet. Hey, buddy. Okay. Oh wait, will this respawn all of them? Oh boy. Maybe if I only rest. Okay, then I won't rest. Ceramic shard. A piece of pottery that breaks with a satisfying crack when you're thrown. And right, just distraction. Got it. Something over here. Ooh. A shuriken wheel. Uh, oh, it's for the prosthetic. Weren't you the person that took the kid? Okay, so it could be given to him. I'll go by there later if I die again. Oh my god, I can fight the rooster? Fuck yeah. Why did I do that? <laughs> it didn't even have any loot, there was no point. Who knows, maybe it would have attacked me. You never know. Alright, I guess we're fighting that big boy down there. Can I like sneak around so I'm behind him? Perilous attack. Some enemies require... Some enemies are unguardable. Perilous attacks signif... Sig... Ah, I can't talk. Signified with a danger symbol. When these occur, watch carefully and try to respond properly with each type. Requires a specific response. So deflect, sweep lands, and then grab lands. Jump and dodge. 
Okay, so we'll, like, sweep his leg and then try and grab me. Got it. Okay, I'm guessing that was dodge. Hmm. Wait, was his name? Oh my God, was his? <laughs> was his name General Kenobi? Lord I. S Wolf, take my blood and live again. Oh wait, kid, you're reviving me. Ooh, you are special. Does it cost anything to resurrect? I'm back, bitch! Oh, it's never worry. Safety roll. Okay. See ya! So, oh, I got an achievement for that. Divine Iris Blood grants the ability to resurrect from the dead using resurrection power. One charge is always restored. Okay, uh, let so if you kill an enemy, it'll make it use available again. That's fucking awesome. Suck a General Kenobi. Uh, loose prayer bead. Offering four of them as sculptor's idol will increase maximum intelligent posture. Okay. Gourd seed. Uh, give to Emma to increase the maximum uses of the healing gourd. Who's Emma? I'm guessing I'm gonna find her soon. Okay. Okay, so I'm guessing that little timer on the bottom corner is when I can use a resurrection again. Oh great, more ash. Oh, I should have pocket sanded him. There's a lot of guys here. Also, wait, can you run away? Oh, they're shooting at me. Like, can people just, like, find you and track you all around? Or, like, can you run away and come back? I mean, they're in the yellow. Do they know where I am? Also, I'm guessing that uh, bar comes back up when I kill enough enemies. The music stopped, so I think they lost me. If I peek out over here, will you see me? Okay, he gave up. So, I think there were four of them. Or at least four left. Also, I have no idea if there's even fall damage in this game. Oh, they saw me. Nice shot, man. Pick that up. More shards. Oh, that's a big boy. You don't see me. I'm a ghost. Or a wolf. Whichever you prefer. But I'm gone. You don't know where I am. Go away. Stop Stop walking over this way. Oh, he saw me. Does he still see me? There's a lot of guys here. Should I even try and kill them or should I just keep going? I, mean, I think that's the way I gotta go. Because this is just a giant... There's nothing over this way. There could be loot though. You never know. Hmm. Oh boy.
Alright, we take out that guy. Come on, pal, just me and you. Okay. And it looks like, uh, that one guy where the resurrection thing's filled again. Oh, where are you? Inosuke, my son, have you seen the young master? Hmm. What? Nothing to say? Does your stomach hurt or something? You always had a weak stomach. Hmm. Well, anyway, take this bell. It's a charm I made with the young master in mind. Please, offer it to Buddha for his sake. Okay. A bell charm received from an old woman who asked that it be offered to Buddha. Bell charms protect their holders through Buddha's divine protection. If one finds themselves the owner of another's bell charm, offering it to Buddha on their behalf is common courtesy. The sculptor at the temple can advise on how it should be offered. Okay. You're not Emma, are you? Inosuke, my son. Have you offered the bell charm to Buddha? Have you tried the rundown temple with that stubborn sculptor in it? I'm sure you'll find Buddha there. Yeah, okay, uh, next idol I find, I'll teleport back to him. Just for you. Oh, is this guy alive? Uh, who is it? Is somebody there? Oh, you're blind. Yes. That voice. No. Could it be, sir? My name is Inosuke Nogami, a vassal of the Harada family. Wait, are you or at least I her was. son? I ask a favor. Might you look in on the old lady in that house? She's my mother, but her mind is failing. She cannot tell one from another. I met lady, your, your son's right here. Gave me a bell. She did, did she? You have my thanks. That bell's troubled her for a long, long time. She kept muttering incoherently. Something about offering it to Buddha. Yeah, I got that. Okay, is there going to be any other checkpoints soon? We're running kind of low on time. I don't really want to go back to where the checkpoint I found. Hey, I leveled up. You know, I think they saw me. Still see me. Keep going. Don't stop, don't stop. Ah, uh, great. More animals. More stuff. Oh, he's got like a bazooka. Oh, it was like a cannon. Oh. Oh, wait, there's one up there. Okay, let's go to that. Sorry, chicken. Looks like you're about to fight me. I am going to throw down right now. Okay. Rest. Physical enhancements. Okay, that might be leveling up. Oh, I need the prayer beads. Got it. Um, okay, let's go back to the dude. I have the tool I can give him. Something about the bell. Yeah, I think that's it. Oh, who are you? Are you Emma? You truly returned from the dead. The power of the dragon's blood. I never thought I'd see it with my own eyes. Who are you? My name is Emma. Yes! I am a doctor serving a certain master. What master? Forgive me, but for his safety, I cannot reveal his identity. Is it that guy in there? My master gave explicit orders to assist you in any way I can. It's not the boy, is it? I'm not telling you to trust me. However, 
I must fulfill my master's orders. The gourd of medicinal water you possess, that was originally a creation of mine. Oh, I thank you. Doctor, and I will assist you in that capacity. Okay, well, here you we go. This gourd. Yes, it was intended for Lord Kuro, but it seems he entrusted it to you. I'm sure you may have noticed, but the medicinal waters in this gourd spring forth on their own. Even after being emptied, you will find it full again after a short rest. Yes. Is there a way to improve it? Bring me gourd seeds. Gourd seeds? Yes. Medicinal waters flow from gourd seeds. Adding new seeds will increase the volume of these medicinal waters. If you find any, bring them to me. All right. Oh, if I should say that, I got one right here. Is this a gourd seed? Yes. Just Bring have like a here. random seed in my pocket. The seed is this it? The gourd. Perfect. Now the volume of medicinal waters in your gourd will increase. All right, sweet. So I can use it two it's times. Strange medicine. Is it strange? Yes. Hm. I don't take any offense to that. If it's effective, then that's cause for celebration, whether it's strange or not. That's what my mentor Dogen taught me. I see. Please bring me any other gourd seeds you find. I should be able to further increase the volume of the medicinal water. Okay. Oh? Did I hear the ringing of a chime? It was probably this bell. I was told to offer it to Buddha. Does the bell hold any significance for you? If it does, talk to the sculptor. He is quite knowledgeable when it comes to Buddha. I mean, it doesn't offer me anything, really. Some old weird lady gave it to me. What's up, dude? Hmm. What is it? Seems to me your battle since has returned. You're more like a shinobi than before. If only a little. Take this. Shinobi S or esoteric text? Text. A book of secrets that details a variety of techniques employed by shinobi. Why didn't you give this to me before? Grants the ability to learn shinobi style skills. And with this text, your innermost secrets of the shinobi arts such as attacks performed in the air and hiding on one's hiding one's body to avoid detection. Such moves can never be practiced by samurai. What is it? Shinobi techniques recorded within are fighting techniques that cannot be performed by samurai. Hmm. Whether you make use of them or not is up to you. Shinobi aren't the only ones with their own fighting techniques. Okay. Owning the text of a combat style will allow its skills to be acquired in the sculptor's idle skill menu. Okay, you're talking to me about skill points. I found one. A shinobi tool? That yes. and a bell. I said before that your prosthetic arm was a fang. But by fitting shinobi tools to your arm, you'll be able to change the form of that fang. Thick shields, break them into splinters, swift foes. Bring them down from afar. Fitting more devices means more ways to slay your enemies. Can if you make it gold? If that needs killing, there's a proper way to kill them. That's all there is to it. Hmm. Seems you know this prosthetic very well. <laughs> I should calm myself. The more I speak of bloodshed, the more demonic my sculptures will become. Give it a year. They all look the same. I'll fit that tool for you. Okay. Regular shinobi tools found in the world can be specifically adapted to the shinobi prosthetic via the fit prosthetic tools menu. So what is this? Oh, it's shuriken. It costs spirit emblems to use? The hell's a spirit emblem? So you can pull a shuriken loaded into a wheel and launch it at a target in a single flowing motion. Okay, so it's... Uh, Ranged item. Cool. So can you have all of them on at once or can you like only swap them out? Also I have a no matter what this. I do, any Buddha I carve is an incarnation of wrath. Thus is the fate of those who owe a deep karmic debt. You will understand when you try carving one for yourself one day. Nah, I'm good. So, need something? 
Um, wait, how do you present the tool yes, or the bell? Right. That kind faced Buddha you see over there, don't do anything funny with it. Okay. So you have to equip them. Okay. So I'm going to have three at a time. Okay, well, this video has been going on for too long already. And I don't know how long this bell is going to be used for. It might be a couple minutes. It might be like a whole new segment. So I'm going to leave this one here. So thank you all for watching. Be sure to ever down below. Leave a like, subscribe, share. And I'll see you all in the next part. Goodbye.